By the 1920s, cremation was becoming an option for an increasing number of California families. Bernard Cahill, the renowned architect who designed the original Cypress Lawn Mediterranean-style administration building on the West Campus and the grand public mausoleum behind it, took on his last major Cypress Lawn project, the proposed 20,000-square-foot Lakeside Columbarium just south of the Grand Entrance Gateway within the East Campus. Construction began in 1927. Then came the Depression, and work on the building abruptly stopped in 1930. Fortunately, the ground floor was finished. It featured 29 varieties of imported Carrera marble, elaborate closed and open-faced niches, opalescent glass skylights, and a dozen private rooms facing the lake. A small fourth floor, which contained rows of more modest niches, was also ready to be populated. The master plan called for 10,000 niches, which would have made this facility the world's largest columbarium. The structure, which included a spectacular interior courtyard and was topped by a glass roof, was left unfinished. Its effect, not unlike that of an ancient ruin, is surreal. The area is not open to the public. Over the years, numerous plans have been presented to complete the project. Cypress Lawn is currently reviewing a new proposal for this charmed spot.